CrossFit a cult? Good morning, everybody. Today's gonna be an awesome day. It's Saturday. I'm gonna be taking my wife. We're gonna meet up with some friends and we're gonna do some yachting. Uh, yeah, gonna be a good day. Very excited about this week. I get to start back up on SUPS. So I've restocked my SUP cabinet here. Oh, baby. Oh, that's the good stuff. Oh, and don't forget about those. Yeah, I go through a lot of that. I love that I started today with the good old rolling machine. What a great way to start your day, great way to start up your cardio, great way to start your sweat. Uh, that's a lot of sweat happening today. Plus, it just pumps you up like crazy. How often are you switching up your workouts, your cardio? How do you get even started? I've been on the treadmill probably for over a year as my six, seven minute warm up before weights. Riley and I were talking just the other day about the rowing machine and I was like, why do I not do the rowing machine? It's, it's bloody awesome. So I'm all friggin' pumped up. I think my back is all friggin'. Anything going on back there? Anything good? Less than five weeks to the Olympia. This is gonna be a sick cut, yo. It's not exactly gorgeous out, but great day to be on a boat. Kind of strange they're asking me to drive the boat. I mean, I have no idea what I'm doing, but I mean, he's the captain, right? So, this might get choppy. They call me Captain Colleen. You can see it in my face when I'm playing in the water with these guys and just uh, de-stressing, um, taking me back to simpler times. I wanna recommend that if you're at all in touch with your high school friends or junior high or kindergarten, reach out to them, stay close. You can't, it's hard to ever, you can't replace those relationships, you can't. And what they do for your soul is so good. on this boat reminds me what a beautiful, beautiful city we live in. It's just been one gorgeous view after another. Beautiful greenery, beautiful water. Uh, this is peaceful. This is the good life. So I started tray three today. So only 10 or 11 days in now, and I'm pretty psyched. You can see my bottom tooth. That guy who was way over there has slowly started shifting this way. Now I'm gonna pull off the tray so you can actually see how easy it is to get these trays in and off. Off and on, yeah. Uh, and you can see the tooth significantly over, and I'm very excited about that. Have a great week, we'll update you soon.
Oh, do I feel dumb right now. I just devastated my legs. Then I remembered tomorrow is my first day of CrossFit. There's, uh, there's a little bit of legs involved with CrossFit. I, I see them do some squats and such. Idiot, idiot. Oh, it's gonna hurt. Going off to a Soyuz for a week. So oh, uh, I gotta have enough food. That's how you travel proper if you want abs. Just doing myself a quick Costco run and I got my boy Zach who came up to me. Said he uh, knows me from YouTube and social media and Popeyes, you which bet. is so funny because I'm wearing a Popeyes shirt. Is it just me or is Costco the bomb? I freaking love this place. Go Costco, go Costco. Ah, ah. So as you can see, we eat a lot of blueberries in this house and I go through a lot of egg whites and then some Epsom salts to help the muscles heal. And if you guys haven't tried <clears throat> that stuffed salmon, that stuffed salmon is so bomb. Highly recommended, only at Costco and also Nutella. And yeah, it's denture stuff for my uh, Invisalign, okay? I'm not that old, give me a break. Stopping in one of my favorite Popeyes in the world, Popeyes Langley. These guys rock out here. That's it, there he is, there he is. So today is the first day of CrossFit. It was really dumb to do legs yesterday, really dumb. Uh, so that's got me in deep fear, uh, but we're gonna have a great time. Uh, great, great crew uh, at CrossFit. Great crew at Hybrid, who's gonna be going through the motions with me today. Uh, Nate and Nick, uh, both top seven in the world for their age group. These guys are intense, and uh, I don't wanna embarrass myself too much, but I also don't want to be injured. So, we're gonna have a good day. I uh, hope you guys enjoy laughing at me and, and watching my epic fails and watching me uh, die uh, at, at hybrid today. I want to give a shout out to my boy Matt Ryan. Uh, Matt Ryan is part of my notifications crew and I'll tell you what that's all about in a second but uh, Matt Ryan is uh, is a bud and he's going through chemo treatment right now and I just want to give him a, a big old shout out. Matt, you're the man. You're strong. You're gonna destroy this thing and uh, and thanks for having me on your journey man. Uh, for everybody else who wants to be part of my notifications crew, that means you gotta subscribe. Please subscribe to my page and see this little bell right here, bing, bing, bing. Uh, you gotta turn that on, that's the notifications. That lets you know when I post my video, which is every Monday and Thursday at 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. I do shout outs and I do special prizes just for my notifications crew. So it's really important that you turn it on. All right, have a killer day. Yeah, this is happening. We are at Hybrid. Hi, Erica. Hello. Erica is to blame for all this nonsense. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna do CrossFit for the first time. This is gonna be painful, embarrassing, but totally awesome. Fitness rules. All right, so we're about to get started. Uh, I'm nervous, but it's gonna be awesome. So I've got to get myself well moved up because tomorrow is going to be weird aches and pains that uh, I know I uh, will not be used to. And the joints and muscles are going to be uh, pretty upset at me. And I will probably drip all over their bars. Serves them right for working me so hard. What's up everybody, here at Hybrid. Super excited, super nervous, but I'm with my man Nate. Nate, I mean, freaking look at this guy, first of all. Nate is the owner here, he's, uh, I've known him for 
what, like eight years or something yeah, like that? No. And uh, watching this guy perform is just incredible. So I'm hoping he's gonna show us some moves today. But I really trust this guy. This is why I came here as my first CrossFit experience. And uh, Nate, please introduce yourself. Just give us a little bit about you. Uh, Nate Beverage, Hybrid Athletics. Uh, like I said, we, we opened about seven years ago. We're located in Murrayville and Langley. We've been doing CrossFit, boot camps, personal training. I've got a background in kinesiology from UBC. Uh, worked with a lot of like elite athletes and stuff, and then mom and pops, and, and we wanted to bridge that gap here in the Fraser Valley. Felt like it was a hole that could be filled, uh, and we've been pumping ever since. Uh, CrossFit really did well for us. We blew up our business in that regard. We went to the games a bunch of times. Uh, last year I went to the games as a master's athlete uh, in the 35 to 39 category, and uh, I just really enjoy what I do. I get to, I get to play every day, as well as make a difference in people's lives. Uh, and hopefully together we do that uh, today. Let's get it done. Nate did an amazing job at explaining why so many people call CrossFit a cult. When you get involved with something that's truly life-changing, these are, there's so many people going to CrossFit who don't work out, who have never 
experienced this kind of exercise, this kind of exhilarating excitement, the amount of serotonin, the amount of endorphins that are being released, it's so rare to these people, it's so new and foreign, and it's changing their lives. They feel healthier and happier all day long. They're feeling their muscles work possibly for the first time in their lives. Of course they wanna tell people about it. Of course they wanna tell their families about it. Of course they want their friends and their family to experience what they are experiencing. And of course people say, that's a cult. You're trying to drag me into this thing. There's nothing negative about it. It's all positive. Sure, there are bad coaches out there who get people lifting too heavy, who get people who aren't lifting properly and they're pushing them harder and yes, they get injured. The right coach, like Nate and like Nick, will do so much good for your body and your mind. CrossFit is legit. Try to squeeze your right. Yeah, nice. Ooh. Ooh. Yes. Ooh. Oh wow, that hurts something to do. Oh. Ah. <laughs> 